Hello my beautiful friends and welcome back to my channel. I'm very excited to be here today because today I'm going to share with you what's in my bag. I haven't done one of these videos literally in ages and so much has changed. Obviously I'm a mother now, I've been a mom for six years now and the stuff that's in my bag is usually half Alexa's and half mine so it's almost like what's in our bag but Alexa's not here today I'm gonna share with you literally everything that's in there and this is a very realistic what's in my bag I haven't really done anything special this is usually what I have day to day in my bag so let's get started one thing I want to mention is before I used to wear a lot of smaller bags a lot of bags that weren't quite open like you can see this one is literally like an open tote bag and I feel like ever since I've had Alexa I just gravitate naturally towards tote bags because I feel like as a mom you need to have so many different things in your bag notebooks crayons snacks and all of that so I'll pull out the first thing that comes to me and this is a bright yellow thing here and I really love in this tote bag there's actually a little I don't know if you can see but there's a little compartment that is made for water bottles and I feel like every bag should have that and this is not my water bottle, this is Alexa's water bottle. I just cannot carry two water bottles, so I usually just have hers. And if I'm ever very thirsty, I'll drink from hers, but usually it's just her drinking. And then I forgot to give her hat this morning, so I still have Alexa's little blue cashmere hat, which is so soft and cozy. Gosh, there's so many things in here, I don't even know where to start. So I see a hand cream, and this is something I would say I don't really have in my bag in the summer, but I usually have in my bag in the winter time, and because it's winter now definitely this is something that's very useful my hands get so dry in the winter time I'm just gonna apply a little bit now since I pulled it out this one smells like rosemary and I really love this all-natural hand cream this is from Dalesford if you're from England or London you would recognize this brand they have really nice organic shops they have their own farms I really I love supporting Dalesford and what I really like about this hand cream is also that it's not in a plastic tube this is I think an aluminum tube and yeah it's really nice it smells really good and it does the job of making my hands really nice and soft. Next thing that I can see here is something that I always have. I feel like as a parent, you always have to have tissues in your bag because things can go wrong at any moment. It's easier nowadays, she's older, but still there's runny noses. And also for myself, sometimes I feel like I need to have tissues as well. And I really love this brand. This is from the brand, the Cheeky Panda, because most of these tissue papers usually come in single-use plastic packets and this one is just in a box it's just a paper box so i really appreciate that it's not plastic next i will show you my notebooks because i usually have my notebooks in my bag these are from our brand intelligent change and this was my own initiative for, because for many years i felt very guilty buying notebooks because I felt like I am using raw paper from trees that have been cut down and I just had this guilt so I tried to reuse papers that were printed old bills or anything and I would just write on the back of those old papers because I just felt really bad buying notebooks but now we've created our own line of recycled 100% recycled paper notebooks and this is essential notebooks. I really like having them in my bag day to day because they're lighter. We also have the more premium one that is bound in linen, which is really beautiful and luxurious, but it's a bit heavier. So I have these on the go. And as you will see here, oh, making notes all the time, writing kind of video ideas or any other ideas that I have go in these notebooks or making notes during meetings, literally anything. And I usually have an extra notebook for Alexa because if we're ever out in a restaurant or cafe, I always like to have some extra paper for her to draw. I also have Alexa's book that she was reading this morning on the way to school. And this is called Rainbow Magic. Her grandma Lydia gifted this to her. And it's amazing that she can read by herself now. I don't even need to read to her. And I still read to her all the time and I enjoy reading. And it's such a nice time that we get to spend together. But she also loves now reading all on her own. Now I see some sunglasses here. So I don't know why I have sunglasses in my bag. Because quite frankly, I don't really wear sunglasses 
almost ever unless we're away in an extremely sunny place and maybe then I'll pop them on. But I have two pairs here and I'll show you Alex's and mine. This is quite a new pair. I bought it this summer. The brand is Tiffany's. Yeah, I believe this is Tiffany's. And I had the hardest time finding a pair of sunglasses because I wanted to find something that is not a plastic frame but a metal frame like this one is and I've tried so many and nothing really looked good but this one I feel like suits me quite nicely they're large the only thing I'm not crazy about is that if I wear it for too long and I take it off it leaves a little spot here like around the nose and then it takes maybe five to ten minutes for that spot to go away but I still like them I still wear them once in a while but usually not in London I love the sun on my face and then these are actually Alex's let's see what brand is this Oliver Peoples, Oliver Peoples, and I actually like the way they look on me as well. So I do wear them once in a while, but yeah, I like to carry his sunglasses because he never really carries his sunglasses. And this pouch is really nice. I've had it for a while from an old Ray-Ban. I think maybe this came with Alexa sunglasses and I just, oh, I remember what happened. She really loved my Tiffany case for the Tiffany sunglasses because it comes in that really beautiful blue color and she exchanged the case for her little case, which is the Raven soft case, but I actually quite prefer this one because it is soft It doesn't take a lot of space and it's light so it doesn't make my bag heavier So I really appreciate that next of course You will see there's a, my phone and there's a little compartment specifically for the phone the latest version of the iPhone I've lost track of what the version is at this point and I have a picture. I don't know if you can see of Alex, Alexa and Adriana. This was this summer in south of France and they're just on a hammock and the girls are cuddling on top of Alex and it was such a joyful moment. As I'm sure you have noticed, I don't have a case on my phone. I don't recommend this, but Alex really got me into it because he hasn't had a case on his phone for years now and I remember telling him that he's crazy because he's gonna break his phone or break the screen and then he said just try it, try it for a week and you will see and I did and it's so hard to go back to having a case now I have some snacks I have obviously when I pick Alexa from school I have to have a snack or two or three or four because she has a healthy appetite and the first question when I pick her up is, Mommy, what snacks do you have today? Any of you who are parents, let me know if you can relate. So today I will take with me these really delicious chocolate almonds. And this is from the company called Raw Chocolate Company. And I really love this because they don't use real, it's, a, it's sugar, but it's coconut sugar, which has a lower glycemic index. And the first ingredients is almonds, then there's the coconut blossom sugar, uh, cocoa butter, and vanilla. So it's like only a few ingredients. It's very delicious and it's one of my favorite snacks. And also I have a little container here with some sliced peppers because one of her favorite vegetables is peppers. So it's all about balance. We usually start with peppers and then I'll give her something sweet. So vegetables first. And then one more snack. Would you have ever guessed that I'm going to pull out a tangerine from this bag? That's a parent life. These are the snacks I'll take with me today. Now, the inside is empty. I'm going to go into the side pockets because I have two, one on each side. And uh, yeah, I see a lot of interesting things in here. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys is this lip balm. So this one is one of my favorites. It's actually what I'm wearing today. It's very natural brand. I actually discovered this when Alexa asked me to buy her a lip balm and I wanted to buy something natural, but she wanted something that has color in it. So this has just a tint of color and it's cherry flavor and the brand is called Hurrah. Then I have this lip balm from Hourglass. Let's see what color this is. I don't really use this often, maybe sometimes when I film videos, but quite frankly, I still prefer the more sheer lip balms rather than a lipstick. So this one is a Pure Velvet Story. That's the name of the color. Actually, I'll swatch these so you can see. This one is quite nice. As you can see, just enough color. It looks a bit red, but on the lips, I feel like it blends with your natural lip color. And this one is more of a dark, dusty pink color. So it's more intense. I don't really wear this day to day. I don't have much makeup in my bag. 
but when it comes to lip products, I love having a variety, even though I usually wear the same thing. Of course, I have an old receipt. I'm notorious for having receipts in my bag. I don't really have a wallet anymore. I have a wallet, but I don't really carry it with me anymore because I use my phone to pay for most things. I use Apple Pay. I do have some of my cards still, so that I have a bank card here. I have plasters, of course. When you have a child, you have to have plasters just in case. So I have two here. Alexa's hair ties. I always have her hair bows and hair ties in my bag. And it's not even that she needs them, but they always end up in there. And I feel like I like having them there because if we're not together, I feel like part of her is always with me. So I see more things here. <sighs> Don't ask what. This is a hairnet. And the reason I have this in my bag, it's not even for myself. Like I said, half of my bag is Alexa's. When we go to ballet, I have to put her hair in a bun and I have to do it in a very specific way. <laughs> And the hairnet is part of it. So I have to do, I have to put in a ponytail, then put the hairnet, and then put the pins in her hair. And yes, I do have the pins for the bun, for the ballet bun. But I'm done with this side of the bag, and I'm gonna do the other side. Let's see, ooh, there's quite a lot of things here. All right, where do I begin? Headphones. I am team wires even though they get tangled okay i understand people who like the airpods because yes when i pull this out and it looks like this it takes me at least two minutes to untangle it before i can start listening to whatever i need to start listening and, Ooh, i have a little sample here i'm not even sure i can show this to you guys but i will i'll show just one side of this it's a little product sample and yeah, it's a pen holder, maybe. <laughs> anyways, I won't show the other side, which has something special on it. But anyways, that's one of the samples that I've been testing for Intelligent Change. And yes, it is a pen holder, which I've been looking forward to for so long because I need one in my life. And let's see what else we have in here. 50 pounds. I barely ever have cash on me, but I like to have at least 20, 40 pounds just in case sometimes I'm in a cab and the machine doesn't work, the payment processing machine, and I'm always so grateful that I have at least a little bit of cash, but I usually do not carry more than 50 pounds. So that's all I have in here. A few more, one more debit card, bank card. Oh, and this little card Alexa wrote actually yesterday and I put it in my bag because it's so sweet. And inside she wrote, I love you, Mama and Papa, so much. Thank you for being my parents. Love, Alexa. And then it's her little drawing. It's gonna hold this forever and ever. And then I have a couple more things here, which are markers. And these are all Alexa's. I love having this in my bag again in case we're somewhere and she's a bit bored. And then I make sure I have the notebook and the pens or the markers and then she'll just draw for hours or we'll play tic-tac-toe or we'll do something else with paper and pens. Thank you so much guys for sticking through the whole video. Now you know what's in my updated bag and I would love to hear what is something that's in my bag that is also in your bag. I would love to hear that. So make sure to leave me a comment down below and please subscribe for more to make sure that you get a notification every time I post a new video. I love you guys and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!